Mm -hmm. Got a special delivery letter for you. Mm -hmm. Sign here. Mm -hmm. Okay. Edgar, you shouldn't smoke a pipe and your magazine at the oh. same time. That's oh. silly. Here. <laughs> Hello, dear. Say, reach in my side pocket. There's a special delivery letter there, and it might be important. Oh, well, look here. Oh. There. Special delivery letter. Oh. My goodness. We haven't had a special delivery in a long time. I wonder oh. who could be writing to you. Dearest darling, you'll never know how much I've missed my little angel cake. Angel cake. Oh. I can hardly wait till my arms once more enfold you. Oh, Edgar. Yeah, it's from Mother. So, reading my mail, you big palooka. Mother-in-law, dear, did it ever occur to you to be that I own this house that a letter might be for me? This letter happens to be from an old sweetheart of mine. He went out west 30 years ago. Oh, and now he's coming for my hand. Oh, and when he sees what goes with it, he'll go right. Back again. Edgar, you shouldn't say those things. I think it's just wonderful that someone wants to marry Mother. Wonderful? It's miraculous. Look, see, if you think you're going to get married and bring another broken-down relative to sponge on me, you're badly mistaken. <clears throat> Tom wouldn't live in a dump like this. Why, well, he's a millionaire. He has acres of oil wells. Oh, isn't that wonderful? Just think Mother would be like a princess and live in a beautiful mansion with loads of servants and butlers and footmen and a major bromo. Uh, uh, cromo. Uh, major, uh, head waiter. Mm -hmm. And around my estate, I'll build a high wall to keep our pests. Well, that's all right with me, Mother. Only be sure and bring that bird brain son of yours with you, will you? Now, if you don't object, I will go upstairs and have a bath. Hmm. I haven't had any objections for three weeks. trying out my new outboard motor. <laughs> outboard motor? Yeah, a friend of mine invented it. Runs all day on a cup full of gas. Well, get it out of here. I want to take a bath. Oh, oh wait a minute, Ed. Uh, I, I bought a half interest in it. Half interest? Yeah. What did you use for money? Well, I, I had a practically give away half of my half for a measly $1,500. What nitwit would invest $1,500 in a crazy contraption like that? Oh, Florence. Oh, well, that's different. Yeah. What? Oh, wait a minute, Ed. You know, your money wasn't doing you any good just lying around the bank. Boy, no, 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 no. Now, Eddie, 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 Eddie,
Over my money being invested in that egg beater upstairs? Now, Edgar, you're always complaining about Brother not working. Now he can support himself. Yeah, my $1,500. Well, I think it was very nice of Brother to sell us a half interest of his half interest. Then when the stocks go up, we can sell a half of our half for twice as much money. Why, we'll make 100% profit on only 50% of 50% of Brother's 50%, which gives us 150% interest. Hmm. You understand, Eddie? No. Oh, it's as simple as ABCs. You'll be making twice as much on half as much, uh, that is, of your half, uh, of my half, of the half that, uh... Well, what's the difference? We'll all be rich in no time. We'll all be on a poor house. Well, you can't back out of it now. I've already paid my friend the money, and we're in business together. Uh, uh, partners? Now, uh, look, uh, <clears throat> where do you find this, uh, budding scientific genius? Oh, the inventor? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> He's down the pool hall. Well, since we're all in this together and partners, why, suppose you go get him and uh, bring him up here to the house. Tell him there's a meeting tonight. And our first business will be to dissolve this company and get my money back. Oh, but, Ed, uh, but... Uh, don't uh, butt me around, butt both of your heads. Oh, yeah. Edgar. <sighs> Howdy, ma'am. I'm Tom Frisbee. Well, come in, won't you? Thank you. We've been expecting you. I've heard a lot about you. <laughs> I'm Florence. Glad to know. Oh. <laughs> Mighty glad to know you, girl. <laughs> and I'm Jack. Howdy. <laughs> <laughs> kind of a pruny critter, ain't you? Oh, Tom. Dart. Oh, oh, Dorothy. Oh, Tom. <laughs> Still as pretty as a cactus bush. <laughs> oh, you always did say such wonderful things. Guess I just got a knack for saying pretty things about pretty gals, Dorothy. Oh, Tom. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, uh, uh, let's go and sit down, shall we, Tom? Oh, sure. Oh. <laughs> to see you more. Oh. Cake? Yeah. Pork? Uh-huh. Food? Uh-huh. Coffee? Uh. Oh. <laughs> uh. Didn't think it would make me shake like this. <laughs> Don't be so nervous. I can't help it, dear. Are you shaking like a schoolgirl? Stop it. <laughs> Love grand. My brother, are you in love too? Uh, that I know of. Uh, not lately. Only Edgar taking a bath. Oh. Huh? Yeah, and he's messing with my outboard motor, too. Say, uh, wouldn't it be safer to have the little fella play with a sailboat? 
<laughs> no. Edgar's not a little boy. He's my husband. And the outboard motor's brother's new invention. He runs all day long on a cup of coffee. A cup of gas, dear. Oh, uh, anyway, we're all going to be very rich. Brother said so. Well, sounds mighty interesting to me. Oh, uh, Mr. Presby, uh, you wouldn't like to invest any uh, money in my motor? Could be. I'm always interested in getting into a good thing. Well, I wouldn't put my money into anything that wasn't. <laughs> Brother's quite an inventor. Oh, yes, indeed. He's a regular macaroni. Then come on upstairs and I'll show you how it works. Oh, yes, right. so right. so You'd be so right. right. What a wonderful invention here. <laughs> Uh, see? <laughs> I told you if you listen to me, everything would be all right. <laughs> I must admit, it's working out better than I expected. If this test works out, Tom puts up the dough, and I get my money back, I'll get rid of you and Mother at the same time. Oh, what's the matter with you, Annie? Oh, you're doing? I am reinforcing the boat. Well, don't you suppose that the man who built the boat knew what it needed? Look, with 1,500 bucks tied up in it, I'm taking no chances. No. I wonder where Tom is. <laughs> oh! Oh, you thrusting you! Wait just a minute. It just needs a few minor adjustments here. This needs this thing fixed here. Yeah. And this over here. Let me. I'll start that mechanical uh, view. Uh, oh, oh. oh, will somebody get this thing stopped? Put it back in the brace, you dope. Oh, put it back in the... Thank <laughs> you. 
for a what power? Congratulations, son. About the uh, $1,500 advance? You bet. Just as soon as my first oil well comes out. Ah, that's great. Your first oil well? Yes, sir. And when will that be? Just as soon as I can get someone to finance the drilling. Oh. Yes, and in the meantime, you can marry Mother and come and live with us. <laughs> 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 